I showed you how to remove the top part of the dash when I showed you how to replace the windshield wiper switch. I uh, have been in the process of color changing the dash and reconditioning it. Now I have the bottom that I want to take off. As long as I got the top off, I might as well take this bottom off and I might as well um, color change and recondition that as well. So Rat Trap Productions, we show you how to do stuff today. I'm going to show you how to remove the bottom part of the dash in a 1970s Ford LTD, Country Squire, Park Lane, you name it. First thing I'm going to take off is this uh, steering column cover. Two screws. One here, one here. Vanity cover off. These temperature controls are, are next. I need to take these knobs off. And to do that, you're going to sneak a screwdriver behind and you're going to push it. As you push towards the knob, you're going to pull the knob off. So what I did was I basically pushed this in to allow it to slide off of this. Okay, next is the brake release. Move that. So I took this. This fits right inside here. Push that out, and now I'm gonna release the, the cable from here. So I just took this right here, pushed it in to give my cable some slack, and took it right out. I got one screw here I'm gonna take off. Screw there. The gear shift, I gotta take out that little screw right there. Two screws right here, one there, and one on the other side. Take these two screws out, and this plate will come off. Take these four nuts off, and that will release your temperature controls. Now you're gonna remove the kick panel. There's a screw there. And you're gonna have to remove the skid plate too. You needed to remove the kick panel to get to these two screws right here. So remove those. To get the dash out, I gotta take this shroud off. The way I did that, there's these two point there and there's a point there and they press into this piece right here. So once you get one out you can get the other one off so carefully pry that apart. Now I'm going to take the original Philco radio out. And remove those. That allows this plate to come off. And then I can remove those to loosen up the radio. Okay now we're at the glove box. There's one screw there. And there's one screw there. Here's two underneath the cigarette lighter. Take that one out of the bottom of the ashtray. I'm going to remove this lead. That's a light for the ashtray. Middle ashtray is going to come out roughly the same way. And there's a couple screws right there. And one right there. And one right there. I'm going to take the door off. These. Take the glove box out. One, two, three, and four screws. Okay, for the glove box light, you need to disconnect this from here. This is the hardest part of the dash. So this is behind the dashboard. This is a glove box. And you see these right there? One, two, and there's another one on this side. Those need to be removed. Take the other kick panel off. Take those two screws out. Carefully take the dash out. It's out. Installation is the reverse of the removal. So this is the dash. Here's where the steering wheel goes out. Glove box, ashtray, ashtray. A lot of smoking going on in the 70s. I'm going to pull these out and clean them. I'm also going to take off the trim, clean that up, and probably recover it. I'm also going to recover all this.